Okay, simple GTI oil change. Filter, it's right there. Move the cap. Oh, remove that cap. You gotcha. Did you put it while the fucking... You fucking, you're the fucking retro who had it open, so... Turn it on. Yeah, I, I had it open. Okay. Gotta use some man strength. Is the paint was getting stuck to that. Uh huh. What is that? Somebody didn't know how to paint the valve cover. Don't make that mistake. This is how you can tell when your bushings are shot right here. That side is not so bad. What the? Wait, let me see that shit. And this one right here, shot. Little rubber bushing is messed up already. Need to add coolant because this car has a coolant leak. Cooling right flange. under here from the cooling flange. Um, the plastic one right here. So we're gonna change that in another video. I'm gonna change this one all to aluminum. Um, it's not aluminum. It's a it's a cast. It's a metal. They have the metal ones because these break easily. We'll change that. Right now we're gonna do no change. We're gonna do a catch can install, but there is some stuff that's missing. So we'll do that in another video. Right now we're gonna do a simple oil change. Um, you always gonna get oil everywhere because the way the filter is sitting is sideways yeah, it's better to use one of these so this has a hybrid oil pen mark 4 gti hybrid oil pen it has one of these so you want to get a size 8 allen key that will get it out you can use one of these either or it will help you out so now to remove the filter you're gonna want to get a long extension one of these or you can get another one thing about this is no matter how you take it out you're always gonna get oil into the power steering line I believe but the filter is right there so let's go underneath the car once that's been draining can you hold the camera down here. Please don't make it. Oh, let me get some light down here. I'm gonna put it on first. Then bang it in place. It's such a dumb design. Like, why put it in where there's mass stuff to get oil in? You can't even move this out the way. This is a blunt. Whatever that's from. That's like a delete kit. Oh. See? It gets all over the place. I don't have gloves, so get ready to get the filter. <laughs> if you go to a parts store, the filter you want to get is W71930. I know, but if they don't want to look for it, they just want to go straight to the parts store. You can just get it. That's true. Put a little bit of oil on the seal. Here, put it on. And you put the nut back in the oil pan. Once you put on the filter and the oil bag, you're gonna wanna clean all the hoses that gotta get dirty down there. You are gonna get into a Mark IV. Do not get these headlights. These are horrible. What are you saying? Please, careful with the cursing. I said, do not get these headlights because those are horrible. It will make your car look horrible. Definitely gotta get a new bumper. We're gonna do an R32 bumper or just another GTI bumper. Get the 20s lip. Um, yeah. Just 
more maintenance stuff to this car. It was the second motor. First one uh, blew a rod out. <coughs> By yours truly right here. Find the filter by hand. Right. Oh no, really? You just yeah, use a power gun to it. Yeah, just turn it by hand. Whatever car that is in the background sounds so bad. First thing you want to do to these motors to help out a lot with a lot of boost leaks and like codes and shit, side delete kit. Get a side delete kit, you get rid of a lot of useless cables that run over here. Cleans up the engine bay a little. We haven't cleaned it up yet. We just did the delete kit not so long ago. Um, all catch can. Just keep up with the maintenance stuff. Car shouldn't give you no problems. Once that's done. Rotella. Pretty good oil. Actually pretty cheap too. They had a sale on Amazon. Two gallons for 60 bucks. Two gallons for 60 bucks. Oh shit. Oh. You're not supposed to put the whole gallon though. Yeah, you are. It's only 4.5. 4.5, yeah, but you... Read it. Tell the other side how many liters you're putting in. <sighs> no, really? But you burn oil. It doesn't, doesn't mean overfill it. It's not overfilling it. It takes four and, and four and, and a half liters. Four little ones and a little bit, and half of one. Might as well just put the five. When my engine blows up, you guys know what happened. Just put the five. <laughs> Funny you should mention engines. This engine had no oil last week. Because somebody was running without oil. And you just cover that up. And that's how you do an oil change. And I'm right for a GTI. Check it. Shavings, Cause he ran the car oh without. Oh my god, I had leaves on my motor. <laughs> no, not even playing. This oil is fucking filthy. But no, nah, there's no. There's nothing in it. Mm. There's no metal shavings. You well, should look flaky. I will post after this a little clip of a uh, LS uh, one 6.0 motor we're building for my cousin's car gonna turbo it we just open the oil pan because there was a rod knock in there well, you can see on this one but see that this is kind of the color the gray where it's green yeah, yeah. And that, it's metal shaving. okay so you want your oil typically to look like that right even if it's dirty it doesn't matter so it's not shiny 